What is up, beautiful people of the internet? I am Wesley. I'm Stephanie. And this is Wes and Steph. <laughs> Guys, we are reacting to Sam and Colby's series where they're hunting for treasure. But I'm not, we're, we're gonna be honest with you. We're skipping a video because we're scaredy cats and we had a lot of comments telling us to skip it because the of what I just said. The second one is about ghosts and stuff and we don't do that. We just don't. We're scared. <laughs> so if you're not new here, you know that. If you're new here, you know that now. But we love <laughs> treasure hunting and we really enjoy Sam and Colby. So we're jumping to the third video in the series and it is entitled Found Treasure in Haunted Mind at Abandoned Ghost Town. We're all in. Well, let's do it. I'm ready to see this treasure. I want to see some I treasure. I want to know how clickbaited I'm being. Right I feel now. like the treasure might be friendship. <laughs> but we'll see. How do you guys feel about treasure hunting? It's this ghost town called Cerro Gordo. And it's actually the ruins of this old silver mining town. So We've excited. read there might still be a lost vein of silver there in Cerro Gordo. Well, if you guys can find it, hey. Hey. That's it. We might have made it. Hey. He's like, well, if you guys can find it, hey, I'm going to take it because it's my property. The production value on this is it's so, so good. good. Oh, it's there's no power here. There's no water here. No service. Like, we're like on our own. Nothing. No way. <gasps> oh, my God. That's so creepy. What the fuck, dude? Any old doll or toy does look creepy, though. Yeah. I didn't have any bacon. You. Damn it. Ah! Okay, that scared me, bro. I actually, that's, <laughs> that's why we're not Whoa. watching it. These mountains. <laughs> oh, treasure hunting time. Let's find that silver, baby. That looks like a nice room. <laughs> we have the air mattress, I'm pretty sure. Got it from Walmart. Didn't look, you know, totally. Also, if down. you guys were wondering why we skipped the episode, I got scared when I heard Corey say, Do you have any bacon? So, oh, like, that... I had legitimate fear in my belly. So, that, that that's was the why. Moment. That's why. That's pretty. I've only seen that once in my life, the actual Milky Way. Really? Yeah. Have you seen it? No. This is Adventures of the Lost Cinnamon Bucks. <laughs> wait, wait, did you move them? <laughs> I'm asking for the fing cinnamon bucks. Okay, don't. <laughs> I swear. You, you <laughs> closed shut, the cinnamon bucks. Shut the f You just had if them. If they are in this dresser. <laughs> remember how we said that. No, if they're in the dresser, okay, open them. They're in the dresser. No, they're not. <laughs> they're not. No, they're not. You guys looked at that. Why would I put them in the dresser? No, you put them in the dresser. They were up there. Vince, I was looking for them. I don't trust any of them. Well, I'm more so, I see White Claw on the counter. So I'm like, is it ghosts or is it our good friend, the Buzz? <laughs> Dog, no, yeah. you did not. I put them on the floor. Cinnamon buns you sound good. Them. So you would have had to put them in the dresser. No. I've never opened that dresser drawer. Well, I've been, <laughs> I've been sitting here until <laughs> shot out, but I wanted some cinnamon buns. So you guys are... Dude, I we were sitting what? here the entire time. He's messing with I that. Swear. I think I think White Claw is messing with Jake. Did you, you seriously? Were all smiling. Dog, we were never sitting. Everyone is smiling. Jake did it. Except Corey. <laughs> <laughs> it's scary. Oh, it's so the person who's not smiling is the one who it's like actually messing Whoever with. Whoever smelled it, dealt it. <laughs> These are gorgeous. Or shots. or everyone laughs at Corey. Yeah, the one person who's laughing at the other person. Or or everyone's laughing at the one person who's clearly bullshitting. Right? <laughs> yeah. That's the other option. And the blue's really hey, pretty. Hey, 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 that's not the point. We got it. I think we should just take this go. Dude, this is the best part of the whole video. Pretty yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> what? Hey! Eat out of your ass. Dude, that was for later, man. Hey! 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 You. Who let the ghost out? Bah, he lives. Bah, bah. He lives there by himself, so he's got a whole. Ring. He's not by himself. He has goats. What you don't you don't consider the if goats? If you're a millionaire, why the heck do you buy a town in the middle because of nowhere? Because you like goats more than people, Stephanie, and you like grass more than people, and you like rocks more than people. He's clearly yeah, introverted. Okay. Yeah, the 
Imagine you lived here, you woke wow. up in a little corner of your bed, and you looked out. Wow. That'd That'd be be that's That's incredible. Deal. This is bringing me back to the old explore days. Shower right here? Yeah. So you guys are just chilling over here, taking a shower, and then you look out. That's your view of your morning shower. That'd be nice. Oh my god. What a window in our bathroom. Think that through. Do we live do we live in the wilderness? I still want a window in our bathroom. Do we live in the wilderness? I don't care if people see us. I wanna see out. The perks or not perks of don't having a broken us. back. Those, these are the perks of having a broken back. You just chill. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you get to chill whenever. Do you think we're actually gonna find silver? No. I mean he said he's found it before. I'm a pessimist. Robert thinks there's something. These are like the unexplored mines. I guess anything could really happen. I'm huh? hoping to be surprised. Yeah. I wonder if the guy bought it hoping to start doing tourism there. Uh, so they like heat it up? Yeah, so they'd melt, they would melt down the ore in those cups, and then they would get a little bit of the sample, and then they would sample it here in the assay office to determine how uh, pure the silver was. So the reason they stamp them is because, like, so if you recall one of those bars in your work. All the stuff is still there, like all of the original like mining stuff. He could make it a tourist thing. It'd be for really sure. Cool. Yeah. I'm supposed to have one of those bars. You probably end up, you know, in a cemetery at the top of the mountain or something. Whoa! Well, how much? How much uh, would one of these bad boys cost? I mean, back in the day, I think it was like uh, five hundred bucks. But how about know, now? Adjusted for inflation, that was five thousand bucks. This is five grand right now. Pick it up, dude. You'll be a five grand. Yeah. yeah. Is it super heavy? You're just Pretty leaving it there. Heavy. Whoa! Man, curl it, dude. This oh, is. Oh yeah. Let me see them guns. This Yo. isn't the baby goat, man. This is the three hundred pound goat in the future. <laughs> so this is out. pure silver right here. God, so this is pure so goddamn silver right We're just gonna get the gun show right now, all right? Cool. Please, I need your help. Dude, a little silver Does thing? this kind of feel like we're watching like a, a special on Discovery or yeah, something more than YouTube? Honestly, it's, it's, it's so wild. It, it feels like a TV show It's more better than, than like the stuff that's been on Discovery Channel and History Channel History lately. History Channel for a minute. Yeah. yeah. Dude. Uh, from the rock here at Saragoda. Oh, oh my god. god. Yeah, he gets the rocks, he melts them down, and he makes them into these bars. So he so found really. them recently, like yeah. the last 20 years? Yeah. So they're still silver here, guys. I'm honestly going to keep this forever because I really do feel a deep connection with this place. Wait, he's just giving it to them? That's cool. Uh, Brent's going to take us to Death Valley, but instead of just going on a car, I've been there. on the back of this truck. We're going here, are we? On the oh, side of a mountain. countryside. <laughs> oh, yeah, don't fall out. Oh, god. Cool, right? That was sick. All right. Yep. Fun fact, I'm sorry. I drove for the first time there when I was 12 or like oh, 10. Oh, Death Valley? Probably like 10, honestly. Like on the main roads because my dad was like, there's nobody around. We're going to have you drive up the car today. My sister freaked out. Here, She's not happy. <laughs> I didn't believe I'm trying. Sarah Gordo, we are here to find there? your silver. What? Death Valley? It's hot. I haven't driven to Death Valley. Well, we're going down. No, Okay. Why is he sitting up there? Sit in the bed! He's gonna bounce out! Do you have any diapers? I think I just shit my pants. Uh, I'm better prepared next time. Look over here. And there's a bunch of little cabins like this. And this is kind of the last one that remained. Wow, look at that. Whoa. Oh, whoa. Wow. This dude, you got your tobacco. You got, look at that, dude. I think that's like. I know so like many people pay money to do sort. this. I don't know. What is that? Yeah. Is this your vlog camera? <laughs> yeah, that's what I like to take the videos out here with. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you, you got. Hayden, got, blur that out. Hayden, blur that out. You got jerk material right here. Yo, whose hat is this? It's yours now, brother. Take it. What? What? Take it. Take it right now. Wait, what? <laughs> what? That's well, really he's for, cool. people are for sure staying there, right? Because there's Bud Light cans. Yeah, people And those been are like new there. ass Bud Light cans. They ain't old. That's a cool little building, though. It's super cool. You should make it a tourist thing. Yeah, you look so off, happy. Man. Stephanie has a hat that's identical to that. <laughs> <laughs> this is very serious. I need everybody to quote this and put this in the yearbook when you graduate high school. Unless you've already graduated high school, then just write this down. In the midst of all the destruction, a beautiful rose can still emerge. 
Therefore, in this pandemic that we are suffering in right now in 2020, beautifulness will emerge. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Whew. Whoa. I just saw two green glowing eyes in like that cave. I don't believe you. No. There could be a bobcat, guys. Wait, you think there could be a bobcat Honestly, in there? Honestly, though. And like, we fast forward like 40 years and Corey is the guy on History Channel. He's like, I saw a Bigfoot. It was, it was over there. Dude, I would, bobcats scare me. Of course. Bobcats yeah. are cool. That was my Patronus. <laughs> guys, bobcats there could be a bobcat in there. Lynx is a bobcat. They're the same. No, they're not. Yeah, they are. They're just North American versus European. Are you going through it? Dude, caves? Caves oh, are rattlesnakes. I know, I heard. What if there's... Yeah. Next thing you hear is like... Ah, ah, ah. No bobcat? No bobcat. That's so cool. Come on in. Wait, did you come through here? Oh, yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god, What's that baby. Rock? Rock? That's beautiful. Uh, damn. It's nice in here. Man. Wow. So we're all going through it right now. Yeah. The cave. The cave. The cave. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's Look what's so holding this cave cool. up. Look at the sky. Oh, there's a little snake. What? Is that a cave? <laughs> no way. Did you see this snake? God damn, Jake. Yeah. Look at that ass. That was stupid. God damn. Hey, that was pretty stupid. Addison, Jake. This is so cool. There's a, a lot of beauty out there. I don't usually like deserts. This is the American Hotel cool here. here. The yeah. entrance is right here. These beams kind of signified the porch where you would enter it. This was used to be the entrance, and then back where the stove is, obviously, was the kitchen. And they would say, back in the kitchen, there was a window just above the stove. That was the most common place that people saw paranormal activity here. Oh. They would all see a very similar face that everybody, independently of knowing the other stories, had all seen him out the back window. And what's crazy is even the day that it burned down, Robert, the caretaker, had been giving a tour to a guy, mm -hmm. and they walked out right here out of the porch, and I was doing something over here with the bushes. Oh, and I, the guy recently. turned to Robert and said, did you see that? And Robert goes, yeah, the guy in the, ho in the kitchen that turned to the left. And the guy's like, yeah, I was wondering if you saw that. And that was only like eight hours before it burned down. No oh, way. Man. So there was a lot of paranormal activity in this yeah. hotel, and then it burned down. Do you think after it burnt, though, that kind of like, you know, put ease to the paranormal stuff, or? I don't know, I, I, another thing, I was talking to somebody and they say that sometimes when you start moving things and doing renovations, it disturbs like whatever spirits could be there. Yeah. And we've definitely been, you know, painting walls and moving furniture. And so, I mean, it's a building that sat pretty much untouched for a hundred years and then, that, So there was a hotel oh, there. Yeah, did you see all the buildings in the back? Yeah, there's a lot. That There's so many buildings over there. Just staying alone here, like at Cerro Gordo, like make you more spiritual at all, or like just change, change like the way you view the world or think about things in general, or? Yeah, I mean, it definitely, it makes you slow down a lot. Cause I think that like when I first came up here, you, you think it's gonna slow you down, but I was still like running, I have to do archery, I have to fix this, fix that. Yeah. So it definitely like made me archery. Like, sit still and be okay with sitting still. What that revealed is most important was Cerro Gordo. Mm -hmm. And then we had this, you know, the accident. And so it was heart wrenching, but yeah. at the same time, that clarity gave me, you know, it's you know, what's gonna re rebuild it, I think. Do you ever plan on leaving? <laughs> I don't really? think so. Yeah, I like it here. I mean, if you would have asked me like a year ago, like how had Robert stayed over 20 years, I would have been like, I have no idea. So now I'm like, no, I get it. You get it? I get it. Yeah. yeah. So is, is that your main goal and like mission now? Is yeah. Since, since this burned down, you're like, well, I need to like make this. Yeah, like this best it can be. Building. Yeah, 100%. Two really? saloon doors here, and you'd walk through in this side thing. But this is the card room. This is like. There, there's a card table here. There was an infamous murder that happened inside of the room where there was like a bullet hole in the wall and a blood stain on the floor right here. And oh, I mean, what it's, a it's shame tragic it it's like, That's the type of history that you, know, you just can't replace. Oh, right. I right. bet right. he was right. heartbroken. This is like the floor from 1871. I'm trying to preserve it and like if we could like work it into the new floor as kind of like a nod to the fire, I think that'd be cool. It'd like show some that's charred so cool. pits. I don't know yeah. if that's possible, but it'd be awesome. But now, like, I mean, it took a while to kind of accept what happened. Yeah. But now it's like, I don't know. You know, nobody's been, nobody's seen that dirt in like 150 years. <laughs> yeah. So you never know. True. Silver lining. <laughs> silver lining and a silver lining. <laughs> hey! Let's see if we can get some uh, American Hotel artifacts. What a bummer. 
I'm gonna try the magnet out real quick. Library of Alexandria? Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Not to this day, just such a waste. I found something. Found a screw. Uh. Oh, God. I shouldn't have done that. Uh. Ring. The highest one? It keeps going from the highest to a ring. It still says right there. Oh, wait. It could have been this. It was that. That's the thing about metal detecting is you're going to find a million small like nails and stuff like that and things Especially like that. Especially in a house. You, but yeah. that one in a million chance that you're going to actually find something really awesome. Whoa. Yo, Brent. What is this? You know what this Mel is? Melted glass of some type. Melted glass. Oh. That could be really pretty. What? That's pretty cool. What'd you guys find? No, we found a frying pan. We found a pan. A oh, pan. that's cool. Whoa. Yeah, that's Oh, yeah. And it had all the old like plates and cups still in it, and all like the old so stove, many just antique things. Antique yeah. things. Oh. oh, you guys are finding all sorts of stuff. I'd be like, you know, this place down here is a lot. It's Woo. like all the kitchen supplies. Oh wow, Jake found something. We got a knife. Oh, oh we got a knife. Would you guys want to go there and excavate? We'll that back up and put it back in the. Oh, it just poked me, man. It's already sharp. Yeah. Tetanus. Silver, but... This yeah, treasure. man, these are like that counts. parts of history you're digging up. Yeah. And I think it's cool. What's the worth of things in the world? We make the worth of things. And to this, this is worth more than silver, man. Yeah, fuck silver, yeah, dude. It's all about friendship and having so fun. You said friendship. The mines, then we'll go for silver. Then we need <laughs> That's crazy. That's a cool Do you guys shot. also feel the same thing? Like, I kind of want to stay here now. Yeah, dude, this Last is dope. Night. This place is very unique. Corey, do you have service? No. Dude, I'm literally looking at like my Instagram feed from 18 hours ago. <laughs> oh my god. That, that's the last time I refreshed. That's how desperate he is to get back to civilization. Corey's like, I do not feel the same way. No, I'm sorry. There's something very peaceful and calming and it's like perfect weather. I find perfect. Yes. It looks hot. It's just weird that perfect. both Chris and Brent have said, you know, once you're here, like, you don't know how to leave. You'll be back. Yeah. And if you do leave, yeah, you'll be back. Hotel California. Why did he oh, stay? He said for two years, he had been coming here back and forth. And then all of a sudden, one day, he just decided, I'm going to live here. Dedicate my entire life yeah. to this place. I get it. I get why you can fall in love with this place yeah. so quickly. Well, it's just got a lot of history, right? Yeah. It's got a lot of history. It's beautiful. It's a lot of isolation. But there's like a meaningfulness to it. It's intriguing. It's cool when you know that much about it. Like, yeah. I would have no idea if somebody didn't know all the stories. Think how many other stories are lost. Every story gets lost eventually. Don't go on any ladders. Uh, the ladders you have to figure are 150 years old. Keep a good eye out below you, like on the ground in front of you, because there could be just like mine tunnels that go straight down. Don't touch any rocks. You know, if you see a pretty rock, if you don't want the mine, you know, collapsing after 150 years of trapping us all. Okay, so don't I hope you had him sign waivers. Yes, hold this yes, thing together. yes, exactly. <laughs> to properly claim your space that was your mine, you would have to put up a pole that was at least four feet tall made out of wood. Inside the tin, you would write down who had that claim, and you had to renew it every year. You have to prove that there's like, minerals worth mining there okay. so like you have to show that a reasonable man would spend the time and effort to get the minerals out of there reasonable. they had nailed it here Find they're na not nailed there sometimes they're down like uh they put them down in the base wait a second what the that's, a, that's, a wait, that's, a, that's a mining claim oh my god we just found that open it up oh Ooh, my god that was, that was, a mining claim You've only found one ever? Yeah. Oh my god! Is here, look here. You can touch it. I don't want to do this by myself. So this one is like out of Reno. Uh, Reno, Nevada. Mining claim notice. Oh, dated 1986. March 1986. 1986. That's recent. That's recent. Jody Stewart is the owner that owns Cerro Gordo before us. Oh, oh my dude, god. That's, that's amazing. Wait, what? Did what? We, we just <laughs> found that. This is the coolest thing we found in like six months. Dude, we found treasure! Oh, yes, bro. That's 1986 amazing. though? Seven That's not that long ago. Treasure hunters. Yeah! It's so cool. I was super cool. That paper looked old. 
four, it's uh, almost 40 years old now. That's true. Whoa. Number one. <laughs> That's scary <laughs> looking, dude. Or you can feel like the cool air. Danger, do not enter. It's like, is that this looks a like mine? out of video game. Bro, this doesn't look like a mine. This looks like the temple where they sacrifice people or something in, ah! in Indiana Jones, right? Wait a second. I just want to show you guys this because you can't see it. But look. That's so much scarier. Listen, guys, the cool thing about Explorer is it doesn't matter what you do. You can treasure hunt. You can hunt for ghosts. You can just get off the couch and go to the park and walk around, and you're still exploring. That's, That's true. true. It's literally That's like 45 true. degrees in there. It's, it's freezing. It feels like we're actually going from summer to winter. Feel the cold air it's like blasting off. Super cold. That's so weird. I wouldn't have thought about that. Never. Never. Going going first. First. Especially that. Drastic. I guess it makes sense. I mean, you've done a whole mountain story, right? And she walks us right now. Why would you say that? Dude. To build the suspense. This for reminds the audience. me of the enchanted forest. Remember? Oh, the ritual tunnel? The ritual tunnel. Oh, God. I don't know what that is, but this reminds We're me. We're underneath the god dang mountain. <laughs> of a lot of video games. Dude, they even have the track things that you put the ore in. Maybe they found a Balrog and that's why they abandoned the mine. They dug too deep. Guys. Uh, yo, Brit. What is this? I'm hoping it's not what we think it is. Uh, what do you mean? It's not. Is it? Is it? I mean, is it mine related or? Yeah, is that? Pl please tell me that's mine related. The only thing I could think is we're trying to warn people not to go that way. What? Really? You see that right there? Do There's not better ways to get near people. or touch it. That's dynamite. Oh, what that oh, is right there? That's what's oh, happening if it's crystallized it. dynamite. It would, it would send us into a different, uh, different realm. Oh my fuck. god. Just, that's dynamite right there? That's dynamite. Holy fuck. Why would you just see that? Anything. Anything. Just to tell people not to go. There might be more, so maybe we can go the other way. Spin it around, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Why would they just leave that sitting there? Well, I think you OSHA can't would not it. approve that. <laughs> yeah, where's OSHA? Where's OSHA? Good OSHA, question. OSHA Stephanie. is the government people in America who regulate jobs, workplaces, what? and stuff. Yeah, we should call OSHA on Sam and Cole. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, hey, Jake and Corey are at risk. It's not a safe workplace environment for the boys. Uh, so we're taking this as a good sign that we should not go in this. I don't know if that's what that means. It's kind of in the middle of the room. You couldn't really Dude. tell though. Just stuck straight down in there. Oh, it's a dead end. Dead end. Are you sure? Yeah. Dead oh, like is that what the rope symbolized? Dead well, end. Oh, why don't we look around? It's so end. weird. Yeah, there might have left some stuff here. Yeah. What the heck? There's still grass down here. I mean, the animal is bringing it back. Really? Oh, oh yeah, there's an animal hole right there. There's so much hay, too. Oh, God. There's an animal hole. Oh, God. Wait, 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 wait. wait. It's, it's, a, it's a small hole, though. Why don't we keep looking? Do you look at all the corners? Small hole, focus? snakes. Yeah. So there's a little animal hole right here. It wouldn't bring stuff back, there's a little though. Bring right back here. food. Do snakes oh, make nests? Cool. Damn, everything's so sparkly, yeah. too. I don't know if you guys can see that on the wall. I know. It's sparkling. Yeah. I wonder what the fuck that is. Can you see the sparkling? Let's watch. That's an example of like the dynamite wick. Oh, dynamite wicks. And so they usually use these Zora. wick things to like cut Good the wicks. Me. And usually it was like one foot of wick was one minute of burn time. So if you want five minutes, cut off five feet. Wow. And so, hey, keep that. Hey. That's really nice. Hey. 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 Five feet for five minutes. Dude, this is so That's not that much time. Only one way in, one way out, brush. Oh, Jesus hope God. you're not claustrophobic. Uh, I am. Dude. Oof. I'm just trying not to touch anything. Yeah. 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 Over. Honestly, yeah, I knock would over so... dynamite. Sam wants to knock this down so bad. Dude, you could. Like, if there was a mining oh. collapse, that happens all the time. Sam, am I just hitting the rock? Sam yeah, is you are. A collapse. So, how do we even know if we're, we're finding silver or not? Like, is. Honestly, this is getting to me. This is like. Why, like, the. Uh, this is really getting to me. I feel scared. This is so cool, but so scary. Just that, like, I, I, they could knock one of these beams the wrong way and the whole mine could fall down, especially because... It does not look safe. Who knows when they made the mine? The, the slip was from 1986, but this could have been dug was, originally, like, a hundred years ago. I don't even think they were related, the one that she did in this. Oh, tell sign of what it looks like? Like the ore? The ore is going to be, like, it's going to be... 
potentially green because of the oxidation. Green. But the really giveaway is going to be it's super heavy. So like imagine how heavy you think a rock should be, but the rock will be maybe like three or four times heavier than anything. So lift up some rocks. Hey, cool. That's exactly what he said not to do. <laughs> oh. What happened? Found a bottle. No way. Yeah. Hell yeah. Dude, Dude there's like four different ways to go from here. Oh, oh my shit. god. Now it's just a labyrinth. There. Dude. There. So you haven't ever been this far in the mine? Not in this one, no. Dude. All new territory for us. This is crazy. <laughs> Let's make the uh, the bottle a checkpoint. Checkpoint? Right. So cool, we found uh, some cool. What happened? Yeah. I think I found uh, places in the wall where you just stick the dynamite. It's like perfectly cylinder holes in this wall. See? Like that's a perfect circle. They oh, probably yeah. just stick it in there and oh, light it up. Boom. That's crazy. Definitely. Or it's a secret passageway. Dude, Either this way. looks like a clock. Imagine we find Jean. Oh, I've seen that in Zelda. You, that's where you put the key that you find in the other parts of the dungeon. Yeah. And then you can fight the boss. Yeah. Isn't it funny how we came here looking for silver and we realized that like jeans is where it's at? Yeah. <laughs> silver, dude. We're making some Levi's. We're making Levi's. <laughs> wait, wait, hurry. What do you mean? What? No what? way. Is that what we think it is? Dude, it's like a shirt or something. Oh, I thought it was jeans. Dude. dude these are like overalls. He said it's probably from that time. Yeah. When they're mining. Years. Wait, so we might have an option to find I some mean, jeans back here. I found some fabric already. Dude, imagine if <laughs> we All right, jeans. so where do we... Anything with a button is super cool, because then, like, the button, you can date it a little bit better. So yeah. we'll be able to, like, ask somebody <laughs> and uh, Dude, figure out exactly kind of how... to find a treasure. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> this is... Oh, oh, look at this. Honestly, Stephanie, this might be the most dangerous thing we've ever watched on YouTube. Legitimately, legitimately actually I, scared it, it's for weird them. because it's like I keep going in and out of like getting distracted by the cool stuff that they're finding and being like but th their is. lives are actually completely and totally at risk through this whole process like yeah. they are in so much mortal peril right now it's, it's oh actually my. like oh insane my guys look at what we came on what? holy shit no this is amazing! Dude, this is the first time we're seeing this too. Oh, this is like the first anybody. time he's seen it. Yeah, what? 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 Oh my god. Actually, denim. Denim! Oh, yeah. I'm so excited about yeah. denim. Don't call it the collapse. Dude, that's crazy. An original pair of Levi's sells at auction for over $100,000. And that's probably like the cuff, uh -huh. you know? That's what I'm saying. So like, if this is here, then there's, maybe this is like, you never said that there's now those I get parts it. that they use as dump. We have to keep show. moving rocks and we'll find some that stuff. That makes sense. Oh my God. Good job, guys. Yeah. This is insane. <laughs> this is so cool. Dude, this could be worth something. Yeah, this, this is, I think, is denim too. <laughs> no way! Yeah. Oh my God. I've never found this much denim. <laughs> You've never found this much denim, and you have no, yeah, only found the one. Hey, uh, you guys are good luck. Yeah. Dude, we're actually <laughs> succeeding. <laughs> yeah. Have you heard? He's never found this much denim ever. Ever. We found a mining claim, which yeah. he's only found once ever. And more Just in case there's like ancient Rona down in the mines. I I wonder. What about like the whole canary in the mine thing? Like there's gas, oh, gas? and things like that. Can you have given me something else to have anxiety I didn't think about, about Stephanie? That. I didn't either. They, oh no, <sighs> they could die like seven different ways. More denim than he's ever found. Maybe that's why they Animals? brought. Maybe that's why they brought Corey. Animals, <laughs> mine Actually, collapse, to... gas. There's like three different ones right there. Oh, oh, lost civilization. Within this, the first hour. No way. Cluster. We're actually doing it. Damn, dude, we're actually like we're treasure hunters. We're treasure hunters. Brent just found it's kind of a climb to get there, but he sees fabric that's like stuffed in a rock, and he thinks it might be worth it to climb and get it. I'll go for it. I'm going in there to try to find some fabric. <laughs> All right, can we shine as many lights as we can over there? Oh, it's so dark in there. If you're looking the wrong yes, way, you can't see anything. It's definitely fabric. It's crazy how dirty it is. How does it even get so... It's weird imagining something get, getting oh, dirty. Oh, wait! Like earthquakes? There's like, buttonholes. No, no there's bring it out. <laughs> bring it out. <laughs> bring it out. Dude, that's a collar. Yeah, it's a shirt. It's a shirt. Oh, it's a shirt. How look? Yeah, even so right there. Yeah, there's how you hang it up. Right, and what does it say on it? It's got tags. It has the tag and everything. What's awesome about that is then we'll be able to figure out exactly how old it is, you know? Wow. Holy <laughs> fuck! That's awesome. This is sick. Like, yeah, 
probably a 150 year old shirt. Oh my oh, god. Wow. That's yeah, crazy. Yeah. It's moments like these where it's like. Why are they all ripped up though? Why, yeah, that's what I'm wondering. That's why I'm like, there's gotta be zombies that live in Animal this mine. Attacks. I played Call of Duty zombies, like I'm telling you guys. Animal attacks, mining collapses where they had to rip up their clothes using oh. bandages. Oh. I don't right? know. Because I feel like even mining, heavy duty work and manual labor. Who and just stuff, rips up their shirt? Like leaves in construction it there. sites. Like in construction sites, right? I don't feel like construction workers are just leaving hung, big chunks of their clothes I random don't, places. Yeah. I this just is take really a step strange. back and live in the moment and be like, what the f am I doing? Exactly. Like, we're both 23 years old. Dude, coming on this random exploring trip, now we're like in the middle of a mountain looking for what jeans. What are we doing? What are we doing? 10 minutes later walking. This is all starting to look the same. It's kind of scary. That's what I'm saying. Never never been been pocketed. Does that have buttons? Oh. It does right there. Oh, oh my god, another shirt. shirt. It's a shirt. Why is this a shirt? shirt. Wait, Why are there so many clothes? It's like they've entered a parallel universe. That's some type of MMORPG where the easiest loot is like clothing. You know, it's like, oh, I killed this animal. Here's a white shirt. I don't understand. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god, look at how many gloves we I just I get found. that. Like, there's a drop Jesus. point for gloves. Ten, ten gloves? Nine That's gloves? cool. Yeah, we're getting so stoked over I wish they would have shown the gloves. Is that another glove? That oh wait, oh that's a, a dead animal. animal. Oh my god. What? Oh my gosh. Damn. It's a dead rabbit. He probably rabbit. got lost. I'm telling you. Because uh, nothing ate it. Wait, let's look like right here and then we'll turn back. It looks petrified. Because I think that's where it stops. Yeah. There we go. Oh, oh. Why is it so creepy that way? Oh no, man. Alright, should we turn back? Pitfalls. Yeah. Holes in the ground. <laughs> <laughs> what do you see? I don't see anything. It's just really steep. You know, should we turn around or keep going? Probably turn around. What do you think, Brett? Was, was it like steep? Yeah, he said it's steep. Uh, not steep, not steep, just small. Small. Uh, I turn around. Yeah, let's turn around. Turn around. This is so cool, it's so... What's up, what's up? Yeah. Look at this. Pick that up, Sam. Pick it up. Pick that up right there. Oh! Oh, it's oh so my god! No fucking way. That's gotta be the coolest thing ever. Holy that's god. so cool. Still got the inner workings, too. Well, that's a crazy that's, find. That's, that's a such really a good find. Crazy find. 1729. This, this right? watch is from 1720. That's so cool. What if it was passed down in his family? Brent, we need a fact check. Yes. Yes, I'm showing nice. Oh! oh. oh. Weren't oh. watches from that time period really expensive at that time? Like in 1729, I believe a watch was really expensive. I don't know. I Maybe don't know I'm wrong? 1729 seems really early because the Industrial Revolution wasn't until like the 1800s. And that's when they started mass producing stuff. So anything before that would have been very like handmade. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. God. Wait, is that wow. the oldest watch you found ever? Wow. Yeah. Yeah, take a look. Yeah. Oh, oh, you kidding me? Oh, oh my God. Are you fucking kidding oh, me? <laughs> is he for real? I might cry. <laughs> I can't believe he did that. Damn. Yeah. From 17. Is it broken? 29. And he said this is the oldest artifact he's ever found. <sighs> he's ever found. So we, we succeeded, dude. This is like. Tricky. Don't hand this it to it. that guy again. That or is even before the mine. That's probably passed down generations before even a miner went in those bills. Like, in those holes. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, it, it's probably one of these miners. Great, great, great grandpa's hand-me-down stopwatch. Yeah. It's not even from this time. So fucking We're treasure hunters now. <laughs> this is episode season three. That was so cool. Season three. That was amazing. I'm like blown away.
can't like wait. in all the old books I read or all the books I read, time pieces and those, yeah. that's like the ones that are family heirlooms. That's what you like pawn off or barter with to get money when they're <laughs> low on their luck and it's the last thing they have. So no, October, Janet, you didn't pawn off daddy's stopwatch, did you? Or just like that or your uh, time piece. Your wedding ring almost. You pawned the jewelry? That's how valuable and cool that is, potentially. Oh. Denim, shirt, other denim. Shirt with buttons. Other shirt, buttons. A giant piece of denim. This is the one we pulled out, the GoPro. Literally has a label still on it. And then the prize Best jewel. Price. Here's our treasure, Terra Gordo. I wonder if someone would be able to restore that. Oh, I'm sure there are. They're excellent. Or if they would sure. want to. I, I never understand why some things you restore and they increase in value, and some things I you just restore found and an they decrease. Cowboy yeah, I don't hat. I don't either. Put it on. <laughs> Dude, it fits perfect. You should dog. just do the whole month. That should be the cone of shame for dropping this <laughs> potentially valuable treasure, right? He doesn't the, the like time the piece. cone of shame. Like, cone of shame. This one yeah, fits better look, than that one from earlier. You look like... <laughs> 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 that loud. Oh, oh really? Yeah. So, it's just us now. No more Brent. What time is it? Unfortunately. 10 o'clock. 10 o'clock. We're going to explore this mine by ourselves. Because that means if we find treasure, we get to keep it. Did he say <laughs> exactly. that they can do what that? What sucks is right before we left, we asked Brent to... <laughs> what? Well, what sucks is right before we left, we asked Brent, like, yo, can we go explore by ourselves in a mine? He's like, exploring at night is super dangerous in the mine. Why would Here night... Okay. Why would exploring at night be any more dangerous in the mine where there's no daylight anyways? Maybe because it's harder to find your way out because you it, can't see the daylight. Yeah. But even then, wouldn't you only be able to see that if you were on the, the correct tunnel anyways? Yeah, I don't know. You know what I'm thinking? I think it's because there's ritualistic sacrifices going on in the lost civilization that lives in this mine. Like, and they, they're, they're nocturnal. Nocturnal animals hunt at night. Guys, oh. We are going Big a foot. mine by ourselves. Ch is it the Chibicabra? same mine? We gotta be careful. Or is it a That's different the best one? idea, but it's okay. Ugh. It'll be fun, right? Yeah, yeah. We only have the one last night here. Are they allowed to do this? Man, those rocks are so cool and so unsettling, aren't they? Oh, that's not cool for him to put right there. What the f Oh, God. There was a goddamn mannequin. That's horrible. That's pretty funny. It's not funny. Oh, no, look at you. this. Whoa, 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 what, what, what? Oh! Like Twisted sense of here. humor. No! Dude! Wait. And we oh, got the claws! The oh, dude, no. Dude, look at this! A whole living room, dude. Oh, He's got a living room inside of mine. Yo, we could sleep here tonight. Wait. I, I didn't mean that. Actually, no, that's a great idea. <laughs> you know, since mines can collapse sometimes, you know. Probably yeah. not. But when's the last time that you could say, I slept in a mine? I slept in a mine. <laughs> Overnight in a mine. Overnight oh. inside of a mine. Oh, wait. Isn't this also where a bobcat could be? No, it's got phone service. I, I'm oh, glad, he, I'm glad Bobcat, he and I are on the same page. Bobcats are like this big. I think you're wrong. They're mountain like lions. This. No, mountain there's lions. mountain lions and there's bobcats. Okay, there could be a mountain lion here. Yeah, there could be a mountain lion. That's a cougar. Bobcats are like this big. I'm just saying. I don't care. Fine, we're using the wrong word. Mountain lion. Good. Giant predatory feline. What? What's right behind this? We're not supposed to go back there. You think yeah, so? It looks like it's blocked off. We're not, we're not supposed to go back there. So. Be Natty Light? That someone's gonna fall yeah, down. Like that? Right, you first. Dude! The second level. Right there? Yeah. Is it stairs? It's it's a ladder, straight down. That? Why not? No. What do you mean, why not? We didn't Mom go on any goddamn no. ladders that we looked at earlier. Yeah, because we were with Brent, but now we're on our own. We can do Yeah, that much safer. Mind. Much safer, man. Oh, nice. oh get the. Ow! Dude, you're gonna push him into the mine! Seriously, stop, man. Don't hit my G spot. If we hear you guys scream, we'll know to come back. <laughs> you don't wanna go that bad? Which way should me and. Wait, wh where are you guys gonna go then? Yeah. Same problem. Don't separate! It's gonna split up? That's some cardinal mistake! Oh. Down that hole versus going down this hole. Okay, yeah. so do you guys want to go down that hole and we'll go down this hole and we'll just like keep in like yelling distance? I'll go down any hole. In Wait, so this is the meeting spot? Yeah. We should name it like a like a meeting, oh, like the G area. 
The G spot? The G spot. Ah. Oh, yeah. 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 If you guys want to go to the G spot, just find your way through the hole. Okay, okay. sounds there. good, man. Right, good luck. At least I'll remember the name. Good luck. Don't die, guys. Yeah, Good same thing. to you. And oh, Mary Treasure Hunt. Thank you. Hopefully you're coming back with $500 million. There's a drop right here. I don't think they're shouting distance. Oh, we could actually go down there. What the f is a refund? Let's do it, dude. No. Oh, I'm gonna slip. Don't slip. Oh, I'm gonna slip. Don't slip, dog. Oh, I'm gonna slip. Dog. Wesley. Dog. Oh. Is it going to be easy to get back up? Yeah. Easier than to get down. Yeah, sure, sure? it would be. Oh, I'm going to Until you fall. Don't slip. I'm about to slip. Slippery. I'm about to slip like a Dog, please don't. Oh, f Okay. Oh, my God. What was that? I thought that was another rung. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, you good? You need my hand? No, okay. Okay, okay. Okay. You okay? Really hope. Can we to talk about the fact that this ladder could very well be rotted? No, because I've been thinking it this whole time. Uh, Brent was right. Or that the nails could just be coming on. Done. Dude, that's deep. But it's a lot further than 15 feet. Just don't make it collapse, man. Or I'll die. I'm under it. I know, but I gotta push against it. Yeah, I got you. Thank you. <laughs> oh man, thing. this is that end. What the f Why did you have me come down? Yo, wait, is that cloth? Huh? Right in front of you. No, 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 right, right there. What? Right there. Oh, cool. Whoa. Oh, f it's is a that ah! Oh my God, that was a dead animal. Oh, it was a dead animal. Oh. Holy fuck. Oh shit. It keeps going. Dude, there's no fucking way. I have to go down three separate ladders. Three separate ladders? Yeah. That wasn't the bottom. Holy Dude. shit. Let's go see what, uh... That legitimately looks like a video game level where you have to, like, jump from ladder to ladder, doesn't it? It looks like a good way to die. <laughs> we're gonna Jake found, because this is gonna be a fucking dead end. There's no way we're gonna have two people down there. Yo, look at that. What? That. Look. What is that? Another dead animal. Looks like Mickey Mouse. Oh, dude! That's a lock. That's a lock. What if it was like a lock for, you know, like a... Like a, like chest? a safe? Oh, like a, a chest? A chest or something. What, what kind of thing with a lock would be down here? You know, they wouldn't lock the dynamite. They wouldn't lock their work equipment. It had to be something that they're keeping away from someone. Facts, bro. Silver. Look at that. That's pretty cool. That is really cool. Ew. Look how different colored that rock is. I'm glad they came back up. That was not cool. Yo. Oh, that looks like a different one, too. <laughs> That's like completely different than everything. It's got the sparkles like the other one. I wish I knew more about these rocks. He said. They're heavy, and they're <laughs> black. Really? Yeah. This is like super sparkly. Does the silver sparkle? Why are they slow mowing it? That was weird. What's happening? Oh, What's gonna God. happen? Oh! 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 Oh, 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 dude, it started flying towards us. Dude, the fucking bass behind us. Oh, oh, dog. Oh, 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 dog. Oh, my God. Oh. That's a vampire, bro. I play D&D. &D. That's a vampire. You're in a lair. You're in a lair, dog. And if you start running, there's going to be a hole in the ground. What? What? Where the hell did it go? Oh, we're gonna get back to some gold, bro. I feel trapped. We're gonna get eaten by bats. Anyone know they're down here? Was they all got stuck <gasps> and no one even knows? Dude, <laughs> you and I both jerks like we're gonna avoid it. <laughs> Didn't you say the bats have rabies? Yes, most of them do. Dude, if I get rabies, my mom will be so pissed. <sighs> I know, my mom. That's what's gonna make your mom mad? <laughs> Not this whole video?
Mom would be pissed if I had babies too. This feels like a spin-off. Like <laughs> <laughs> what? 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 Is that Sound the right here. path? What? It landed on Don't your run! Because there's a hole in the ground. <gasps> oh, it's coming back! It's coming back! <laughs> Look, voices it makes are terrifying. What? 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 What's, We're getting fucking what? swarmed by bats. What? There's bats fucking attacking us down here. There's bats? Yes. Everywhere. No, multiple bats. They keep following us, dude, and flying over our heads. It attacked Corey. It literally fucking attacked Corey. Where are they now, then? No, so I you're saying you don't want to go out? That's the entrance. It landed on my head. How <laughs> That's the entrance? Fuck, there it is. Keep behind them. Hello. Corey. Why does it always attack you? Attacking us. Uh, it landed on my head. No, it did not. When me and Jake were trying to run away. No, it did not. If you didn't have your hoodie on, dude, it probably would have bit your head. It started circling us, and then, it, like, I felt it hit my head. And he's like, it's on your. I'm fucking done. So we tried to go down the ladder. It ended up being like 50 feet, not 15. Yo, Brent said, like, the second what? level was like 10, 15 feet down. No, no, it was like 50 <laughs> feet, dude. Was the ladder sketchy? It just, uh, it was kind of sketchy. It was a 150 year old ladder. Yeah. I was just like, it bummed because we spent the entire time trying to figure out how to get down that ladder. <laughs> I know. I'm trying to figure we, out we, we didn't like really find anything. We found something. Really? Jake. Wait, actually? Do you have it? Yeah. <laughs> it fell Look out when they were running for the bats. What was that? What the fuck? Dude! We think it's Wait, like a chest that? or something. To Mickey. A chest? Well, it wouldn't be on a door because it's in a cave. And what are they trying to keep from the other miners? Like, what are you trying to well, keep safe? Like a dynamite box or something? There wouldn't be a lock on it. What if it used to contain silver? Like, they kept the silver in oh, there. Oh, like when they would find the silver, that would be the chest or box that they yeah, put it in and then lock it. it. Lock it up, ship it out. The box could still be there because we, we crawled into a cave <laughs> that collapsed. What the? Why the would you do that? Yeah. I don't the, know, that where you this, found it? This was down there. So maybe the chest Dude. is on the other side. Dude, right. this is a good find. I'm so... You know what else is probably on the other side? Dead bodies I'm so skeletons. emotionally drained. <sighs> this is a We found poster. one of those rocks that we found earlier. You know uh, how like they're all like shiny at the very end of the cave? Yeah. This one's like super shiny. You know how they said silver like it's heavy? Yeah. Feel that dog. Wait, wait, look at this. If you put the yeah, light on that's it. That's what I'm saying is it looks like super shiny. Wait, like, and it's and it's green. It is green. Oh, it is. Is this heavier than a rock this size? Uh, I think it's pretty heavy. <laughs> you don't think this is silver, do you? <laughs> what if you found, what if you all just found the vein? Maybe. We found possibly silver and, and an like, old rusted lock. Silver. These are great finds. Like, Dude, we found so much today. But wait, can y'all believe that we found this on our first like treasure hunt? Glow. If this is silver, we. I like it. that. But that was like that was our goal. Like we came here to find silver and like. Either way, though, we found a lot of stuff. I feel like we have been definitely good treasure hunters. Yeah, hundred percent. Oh, hundred percent. That was so cool. That was way more than I was even hoping. I, I know. I feel like I am not clickbaited. I. If it stops right now. Well, oh no, no, that was legit. That, that was, was super total, legit. I think that was legit. That was awesome. All right, guys. So uh, tonight's our final night at Cerro Gordo. We're gonna be sleeping in this haunted bunk again with Jake and Corey. Um, I think this went pretty well. Honestly, I, I know we just talked phenomenal. about this, but we felt like we came out here with a mission to be treasure hunters, which is a completely new thing on our channel. We've never tried before. I was so And cool. I think we succeeded. Yeah. Obviously, guys, we love the paranormal. We love doing all those videos with Jake and Corey and all the hotels and stuff. Corey Shadow Man. But season three is going to be about getting back to the original reason why we started Explore. Back to like what we've been doing since literally we were in high school. And I think we found that. I yeah. think this treasure hunting thing, like, that even though it's different, this is so much more us than like Definitely. the paranormal stuff. It really taught me a lot and like brought me, me back to the old Sam and Colby, which I really missed. 
And yeah. I think a lot of you guys did too. So please, like, yeah, leave a like on this video if you do like this type of you style. Because uh, that's the only way we will like If you guys like season three content, treasure hunting more than the paranormal stuff, then leave a like. That's literally the only way. Yeah, again, because like we think Corey and Jake are like the paranormal people. You know, they're they're the guys that will go on investigations like that. But that's like, it's hard to drag them around mine. Yeah. Yeah. But we'll always still do that. Again, we're never gonna leave paranormal in the in the past. Even coming to Cerro Gordo, we ended up having some weird haunted stuff happen to us out of nowhere. Trust us, we're not going to leave the haunted, but I think we're just going to gear towards more of the original explore thing. So hopefully you guys are along for the ride. Welcome to Season 3. Welcome to Season 3. Hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, and like you said, leave a like. That's the only way we know. So Subscribe cool. for more content in the future, just it's like this. Crazy. It's crazy. Like, I think this was the I think craziest thing. Like, honestly, this I... This was the craziest thing we've watched on YouTube, just from, like... A pure, like, danger standpoint, yeah. like, actual... And just, like, historical significance and everything. Real. It this was, was real crazy. And really well done. Yeah. Even though we've been around for a long time, we're getting kind of old. Uh, Are we getting old? We're 23. Come on, that's old. We started when we were 16. <laughs> all the, all, all three, two. viewers that are watching us, like, really? <laughs> Sorry, you guys. guys Sorry, guys. Old. Didn't mean that. Yeah, thanks. But yeah, speaking of not doing haunted, let's go sleep in another haunted bunker all night with no power. <laughs> hey. Dude, I think it's so cool. This is so cool. I am glad to say goodbye say now. I've been at Saragorda for, what, two days now? And yep. It's been awesome, super fun. I want to say like huge thank you for allowing us to stay here and stuff, and especially film it. Something I'll never personally forget. I don't know about you guys, but no, of course, that's I mean, just awesome. it was I some of the stories. best time I've had at Cerro Gordo, actually. Really? Last night, Can't not... talk about last night, but it was great. <laughs> <laughs> that was something I'll never forget, and I mean. We found some cool shit. Yeah. Uh, Speaking of finding stuff, actually, uh, we went back to the mines as you Why know, is like just, just the gun around? last night, and. Uh, Boy, Did you tell me what this is? Yeah, that uh, probably some silver. Oh, <laughs> we thought so. We didn't know yeah. for sure. Yeah. Wait, why? You can look right there. See how it's a little. It feels way heavier than a normal rock would feel. Yeah. And there's a little flakes showing right there. Wow. I could test it 100%, but I would put myself at like about 90%. 90%, yeah, nice. dude. Wow. Imagine. So we actually did it. Yeah, they did. Oh, that, no. that, that was our goal. This is not five hundred million dollars. This is probably what, like, but hey, but fifty we, cents. We went out to find some. <laughs> He's gesturing with that gun. I know. Right direction. Oh. So, oh this, this entire series has been only because Brent has allowed us to do this and been our tour guide. There's no way we would have been able to do this mining stuff without him. Or it was so dangerous. So guys, he actually has a YouTube channel. If you guys want to keep up with the ah. adventures here at Cerro Gordo, go follow him, subscribe to him. That's cool. And honestly, the best thing you can help him out is. Obviously, this hotel tragically burned down. Please donate to the GoFundMe. Oh, that's cool. That, that is cool. So bring much. it in. Bring oh, it in. Yeah. Awesome. Awesome. We'll definitely have to be back. Bring it in, man. Thank you. It was great. Meeting no, that was a blast. So that was that's so really fun. cool. Hell yeah. Well, yeah. Back to LA in the next adventure, guys. That's crazy. I love that. Oh, this is honestly a good enough documentary to be on. I, any I, any mainstream I'm network. so curious if they would want to because I feel like if I'm like Discovery on one of these Halfway channels down the mountain. I'm like oh cool they have an internet following they're doing this already Yeah, let's fly them to wherever they're I, going to go spelunking to I don't for treasure. think Sam and Colby would like it though because there's probably so much more rules regulations yeah, it's more produced true. this is raw and we're pretty sure we have a flat top tire because this light just came on um, uh, it yeah. just has low tire pressure, and then you can hear it. You can definitely hear the, the yeah. air like seeping out of it. Not really. Uh, we don't have any service right now. Dude, how are we gonna get out? We're like, like seven miles deep. If, if you do have a flat tire, you should probably stop driving on it. You can bend your rims, and then you're really screwed. Yeah, it's easy can't... to switch out a tire. It's yeah. not easy to switch out a bent rim. No, no Fun service. fact. Okay. Yes. Yeah, That's my super. Seatbelt. No, it's low tire pressure. Yo, that? yeah, it's definitely making that noise still. What is it? No, it's no. like a. Gun it. So let's just keep going slow. Like a nail with it. That would be water. Okay, they're good. There's, there's, there's stuff there. Yeah, there's stuff there. Now they're oh, fine. Oh, fuck. You need to stop driving. Yeah. We got a flat. second flat, too. Alright, guys. Recapping the story because it's so crazy. We were all sleeping in the back left room, right? I woke up because someone was inside 
like I heard the door open, people like walking towards me, so I was like, oh, like should I wake everybody up? Like this is kind of creepy. And I heard like steps, like you know, like this, and then another door open, like they're coming closer. I was like, Fuck. all right, Brent or something is coming to like wake us up or like scare us. Like I should either get the camera or do something. So I got up, I uh, made noise, and then I was like waiting to hear like what they did, and then they like turned back around and like walked out. And I was like, okay, thank God. Like he, he heard that we're awake or whatever, so he didn't have to wake us up. Whatever, it was all good. So I started walking out. This door is closed. So like, we closed that last night. We closed this last, last, no, last night and locked it. And then I walked over here and this, this one was closed from the inside. Yeah, so both these doors were locked. However, I listened to someone open doors and walk like this to the point where it woke me up and like got me out of bed. And then I opened the door to see if anyone was like fucking with us. And I look up to our car over by uh, Brent's cabin and all the doors are open. All the car doors were open? All the car doors are open and then someone walked in and out, yet that was impossible. Why do you wake them up? I would have woken everybody up. You heard footsteps, doors opening, car doors opened, and now our tires popped. Yeah. The day that we're planning to leave. Yeah. And you everyone can't was leave saying, hotel, California. California. you're not going to want to leave. So you're saying something's trying to keep us here? Oh, right there's where they stopped. That's kind of cool. That's a good story. Cool or creepy. It's a good story. Is that where we're ending? No, we got, we two, got minutes. two minutes. What's going on? All right, guys, we just made it back to our They're house. Alive. A couple days, and after looking back on the footage, this was good. That's their house? It's it's bougie. The yeah, honestly, this was one of the craziest adventures I've ever been on, and it, it felt like a movie. Yeah, it had crazy. abandoned, it had haunted, it had treasure History. hunting. Like, we've never done anything like this. Mm -mm, so definitely, cool. and this is only the beginning in so many ways. So if you guys want to be a part of the journey with us, then subscribe right now. We can't stress that enough. Not only is it free and you can unsubscribe at any time, but hey, Good we're about tips. to embark on a whole new different side of Sam and Colby. Don't Season do what they three, do. Season three, get hyped. Like, we're so, so excited for this. We have so many more things planned and just wanted to say if you know a youtuber who you think could uh, stand up to the challenge of sam and colby season three whether that be abandoned haunted or more treasure hunting tag them below yeah again attention all youtubers out there or social media influencers we are calling out to you right now do you have the balls to come with us i don't think so let's find out <laughs> oh, so honestly of though season three, sam and colby normally i'd be like haha yeah okay everyone will i'd be like haha no one's going in a damn mine that could collapse any second, right? I'm not that crazy. We were gonna try to get 300k likes on this video. Let's see if we can do it. If we that don't, I'll so just cry cool. myself to sleep. It's all good. And we just want to say with season three, we're gonna be filming a lot more. I know we took a long break between season two and season three, but that is no more. And if you guys want to keep up to date with us and everything that we're doing, just text us. So this number right here, you can text us. You'll get merch updates. You'll get updates on when we're filming, where we're filming, when the next series are coming out, and just generally random stuff that we're doing around town. So with all that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed the first series oh, of season three. Hopefully you got the season three merch, and we'll see you guys in our next series coming up soon. Adios. Peace. <laughs> That was really good. Thank you guys for recommending it. Oh man, it was so good. That was so good. good. That was so good. Thank you guys so much for watching. Y'all are amazing. That's it. That's crazy. That's it, I guess. Bye. Oh, whoa, that's Logan Paul's editor. Oh, really? Yeah. Interesting. All right, well, we whoa. love you guys. That's That was random. And we'll see you next time, right? We, that's the end, unless you want to say something. Why are we watching it again? Bye! It's not, it's not.